the ruthless quality making a difference for Liverpool's next generation of strikers. For every budding professional, academy football is all about taking chances and making the most of opportunities that come their way. And few are more proficient in that regard than devastating Liverpool forward duo Paul Glatzel and Bobby Duncan. The Red Strike partnership were both on target on Tuesday night as Barry Ludes's under-18 side saw off Wigan Athletic at Chester in their FA Youth Cup fifth-round tie. The duo now have 43 goals between them this season, Glatzel edging it slightly so far with 22 to Duncan's 21. Glimpses of goal were few and far between for the pair during a tense, attritional encounter against a Wigan team previously unbeaten in all competitions. But when the opportunities dropped, both inside the opening 12 minutes, Glatzel and then Duncan made no mistake. The quality of the two strikes was the difference, said Lutus. Bobby also had one cleared off the line but there wasn't a lot else for them. That's the thing, if you put the ball in front of goal for them, they've got a good chance of scoring. When you have that quality up front, you are always going to be in with a chance and it gives your defenders hope. As the game went on, we were catching Wigan on the counter and in retrospect we will think we were quite wasteful. We can work on that. Wigan dominated for periods but were thwarted by resolute Liverpool defending and some admittedly wayward finishing. It served only to underline how the extra quality of Glatzel and Duncan tipped the balance in favour of the Reds, who now travel to Barry in the quarter-finals. Ludas, though was keen to stress the victory was a real team effort. It was a hard-earned win, he admitted. I'd said all week we'd know exactly what we would be up against. We knew Wigan had a threat up front, we knew that when they had to, they'd put it about, but they'd also try to play. We didn't underestimate Wigan at all. They a few bright moments one on one, but overall I was pleased with us as a unit. There were loads of positives. In certain moments of the game we defended well, and sometimes in cup football you have to win games in a different way. When you take the lead early on, there's always a chance the opposition will throw caution to the wind. Wigan created some good chances, they had a decent amount of the ball, but we tried to keep them away from our goal as much as possible. Liverpool's stoic attitude was epitomized by the performance of right-back Jack Walls and winger Luis Longstaff both of whom soldiered on through injury and illness respectively. At halftime, the physios were saying at halftime that Jack couldn't come back on because he had a growing problem, said Lutus. But he said he wanted to come back on, it's his body and he assured me he would do no damage. And then he gets one right in the jaw. That says a lot about him that he wants to stay on. Luis had tonsillitis against Manchester United at the weekend and he dug in. Against Twig and he was desperate to put a few things right and he was one of a few who did it at both ends. Liverpool under 18s are next in action on Saturday week when they travel to Newcastle United in the U18 Premier League.